So, starting today, he's an official member of the team. Welcome aboard. I'm Yuko Nishiwaki. She's our team manager. She'll answer any of your questions. You're a second year, right? Since we're in the same grade, you can just call me Yuko. Let's see. Hey, Miyamoto. Yes. This here's our future team captain. A great runner and places well in competitions. You two are in the same class, right? Miyamoto, keep an eye on the new guy here, okay? You got it. You're the guy who went out with Takeba on the first day of school, right? You're practically a celebrity. I'm Kazushi Miyamoto. You've seen me around, right? Then, long story short, from now on, you're mine after school. You better not think you're getting the easy treatment just because you joined mid-season. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast established a new bond. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the chariot archive. Since this is your first practice, just have a look around and then call it a day. We have practice on Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays. There's no practice the days before tests, though. I'll make sure your uniform is ready for next time. Alright. <sighs> My side is killing me. I might have overdone it a bit. Easy for you to say. But honestly, you're probably onto something. How about you? You okay? You've really been pushing it. You don't even look tired. Uh, what kind of training regimen do you have? You say that like it's no big deal. Meanwhile, I'm dying over here. You're pretty crazy. Uh, kinda sucks. You totally destroyed me. I knew the standards were high around here, but I never thought someone so good would be right in front of me. Okay, I've made up my mind. Listen up. I'm gonna make you eat my dust. Sorry. Didn't mean to get so worked up. Let's get go. Ah. I think I might have twisted my knee. Ah, forget it. Let's go. next year the big meets next year so you've got time just don't overdo it hey you uh, why don't you leave practice early and take him home sorry what are you looking at I'm fine it's just uh, 
My anemia is acting up. Of course. It's just, you know, a touch of anemia. Damn it. I can't do it. I can't lie to you. Look, the truth is, it's my knee. It hasn't felt right ever since that day you first came to practice. I tried medicine, I tried wrapping it, but the pain won't stop. Of course you will. But I can't afford to stop training, so I'll play through the pain. Next year, there's a national competition. Athletes from all over Japan will be there. The regionals don't hold a candle in comparison. And if I want to win, then I have to spend the next year training. A lot of guys on the team are nosy as hell. They find out about my knee, they won't leave me alone. So please keep it a secret, okay? We gotta look out for each other. If I go easy on it, I can make it home by myself. Don't worry about me. You get on back to training. Just gonna sneak back into practice. My mom's been on my case. She took me to the hospital. She insisted after I told her about my knee. She made the appointment without telling me, so there was nothing I could do. You said it. I don't get why my mom and the rest of the team are acting like this. It's exhausting having everyone up in your business. Today they took some x-rays. They'll give me the results in a few days. Not sure why that has to take so long. Oh hey, don't tell anyone about me going to the hospital, right? I'm counting on you. I feel bad for always asking you to keep things quiet. Sorry about that. The doctor told me to take it easy today, but we should still get to practice. Oh, wait, if you're leaving, that means practice is already over. Well, guess I'll just go home. See ya. Hey there. running into you at the weirdest times. Remembered what we talked about last time. Nothing gets past you, eh? So, yeah. I just got back from the hospital. They had the results from my last exam. And, well, I... Ah! You gotta be kidding! Why can't I stand up? Thanks. Of 
funny, huh? All from just crouching down to tie my shoes. The thing you were around. If it were anyone else, the rest of the team would have found out. Thanks, man. Really grateful to have you as a friend. Alright, I'm gonna go train by myself. Even if practice is over, can't skip out on training. Big Meat's not that far off. You're heading home, right? Then we'll train together next time. Take it easy. but he wanted you to know ASAP, so he texted me, too. It says, come to Iwatodai Station. What is that guy thinking? He's get practice today, too. Whoa, where's the fire? Yuko was pissed, wasn't she? I've missed a lot of practice lately. I should have told you last time, but... Um, my x-ray results? The muscles and tendons around my knee are inflamed. The doctor said if I keep pushing it that I... I won't be able to walk anymore. He said I strained it too hard during practice. So freaking stupid. I want to win, so I have to practice. Yeah, you're right. Every minute, every second counts. I can't waste any more time. I promised I'd win at next year's meet and become the number one athlete in Japan. Well, because it's not just about me. My nephew got into an accident and his legs got messed up. And now, he can't walk. But if he goes through rehab, he might be able to recover. He says the rehab hurts too much though, so he doesn't want to do it. He's only five, you know? There's still so much he hasn't done yet. So I made a deal with my nephew. Just, uh, don't laugh, okay? If I become number one in Japan, he'll agree to go through rehab. That's why I have to win this meet, so I can make it to nationals. Thanks for caring, man. But I can't worry about that now. Sorry for all the trouble I've caused and for all the depressing conversations. It's really tough keeping it all bottled up. You were the only one I could talk to. Yuko has good instincts when it comes to this stuff, so she might say something to you. Tell her to come talk to me if she does. I don't want to drag you into this any deeper. Practice? Yeah! Doesn't Miyamoto seem slower lately? Yeah, he's not keeping his usual pace. He thinks he'll make it to the Nationals like that? better to do why don't you give me a hand with the laundry Ugh, the only thing they're good at is kicking up dirt hey cause coach wants to see you in the office okay be right there <sighs> hey uh, never mind <laughs> I think we can wrap up practice for today Hey! Let's walk home together.
so the coach told me my performance has been slipping. I know you didn't say anything. I just think he can tell something's up. It's sore, sure, but I managed to make it through practice today. He said I'd be suspended from the team if I'm hurt, but I told him I was fine. I've already missed practice three times this year. I'm gonna have to seriously step up my game. Otherwise, I won't be able to keep my promise to my nephew. You're right. In the end, it's the toughest one who wins. I've decided that I'll take my chances for my nephew's sake. Even if I mess up my knee for the rest of my life. If that happens, I want you to be the next captain. It's, uh, not exactly the happiest topic. That's just the worst-case scenario. I'm gonna keep my promise, win the meet, then the Nationals. Then I'll take care of money. Nothing can stop me now. What's up? What is it? And what's with the scary look? What do you think you're doing? Just practicing? Well, that's enough practice for you. Get your butt to the nurse's office. The rest of you, get back to it. The nurse's office? Miyamoto, did something happen? a bad liar. You can totally tell he's going easy on one knee. I know you have something to do with this. Sorry, but you're coming too. I just had a call with your mom about your knee. You're throwing caution to the wind, young man. A blabbermouth. I want you to stop before things get any worse. You got that? Please don't do this to me. I need to practice. I heard, Cause. Yuko! And you too? Take some time off, Cause. Practice can wait till you're all better. I can't! I don't have time! Huh? What's the rush? Why do you do these things to yourself? You've been hanging around with Miyamoto lately, right? You must know what's going on. <sighs> Wait. He has nothing to do with this. I don't want you to get dragged into this. So I'll come clean. Truth is, and that's the gist of it. So I need to practice. I have to win, or else. I know how you feel, Miyamoto, but it all depends on me if my nephew ever walks again. So that's what's going on. I don't mind if he competes in the regionals. It's just the individual competition, so we don't have to worry about him bringing us down. Hey, what happened to practice? We were worried about Miyamoto. Guys. I'll let you keep training for now. We'll see how things go. But if I tell you to stop, I'm sorry. You're gonna have to listen, and I want you to go home today. Your mother will be upset with me if I let you stay. Sorry, coach. Everyone, I... I think we're done here. 
The rest of you, back to training. All right, then. Probably all heard already, but Miyamoto's knee is in bad shape. If you see him having a hard time, I want you to stop him immediately. That's it for today. Let's grab a bite before we head home. Sorry I needed your shoulder again. And I was the one who suggested we go eat. Yeah, I'm sure you love lugging all this dead weight around, huh? Really? Well, I guess you haven't been complaining. I mean, I've always known you were tough. Sometimes when I go to my sister's to play with my nephew, I help him into the tub. Even though he's only five, he's still pretty heavy. It must be hard having to do that every day. I can't walk, then I won't be able to go to school, or bathe by myself, I won't even be able to go to the bathroom on my own. And I don't want to do that to my mom. This all hit me on our walk over here, with you helping me the entire way. Hey, let me know if I become a burden on you, will you? I'm not gonna hide anything from you. So I hope you feel like you don't have to either. I feel guilty for making the whole team worry. But first, I have to win at the regionals, no matter what. For their sake, too. Heading to practice? not so good. I can't put too much weight on it. Okay, then let's take an early break. You mind giving Kaz's leg a quick massage? No problem. Let's see that leg. Sorry. You're missing practice because of me. Hey, don't be like that. This is for your nephew, right? Still, I'm really sorry. You have a minute? There's something I want to talk to you about. Uh, actually, let's go somewhere else. I don't want anyone from the team hearing. Plus, it might take a while, so... Let's go somewhere. Anywhere. Where do I even start? It's all a mess in my head. First things first. This is for you. My nephew gave it to me. He said it's a good luck charm. He gave me more than I'll ever need. And if you get hurt during practice, now you can tape yourself up. I wanted you to be the first to know. I've made up my mind. I'm gonna have surgery to fix my knee. I don't think there's enough time for me to recover by then, but that's okay. I don't mean to pout or anything. I'm just trying to stop making selfish choices. I don't think it's right for the whole team to suffer because of my knee and my nephew. Even if I manage to win, I don't think I'd feel good about it afterward. Up until now, all I could think about was winning. But my eyes opened up after Coach grilled you about my knee. It was such an obvious thing. I realized I can't keep thinking only about myself. Winning still means a lot to me. That's part of who I am, and that's probably not going to change. But 
for now, I'm not gonna worry about winning races. I'm gonna focus on winning back my health instead. <laughs> well, I can't exactly force myself to heal, you know? Anyway, I can't just keep asking for your help all the time. That said, thanks for everything you've done for me so far. Between practice and rehab, I'll have a lot going on. But I'm gonna kick butt both of them. And someday, I'll kick your butt too. I am thou. Thou art I. The bond thou hast nurtured hath finally matured. The innermost power of the Chariot Arcana hath been set free. We now bestow upon thee the ultimate form of the Chariot within themselves. I'm gonna go tell my nephew what happened and offer to go through rehab with him. I wonder which one of us will recover first. He's a tough one, you know, just like me.